So in this video I'm going to go through ionisation energy, so firstly uh, the definition and the general trend going down a group. Okay, so ionisation energy is the enthalpy or energy change that takes place when one mole of gaseous atoms is converted to one mole of unipositive ions by the removal of one mole of electrons. So what we mean when we say unipositive, it, um, all the ions have the same positive charge. So an example, uh, if we have one mole of gaseous sodium atoms uh, going to one mole of uh, gaseous sodium plus ions by the removal of one mole of electrons. And then again with chlorine, We've got one mole of gaseous chlorine atoms being converted to one mole of uh, chlorine plus gaseous chlorine plus ions by the removal of one mole of electrons. Okay, so the trend in ionization energy going down a group. I'm going to go through uh, just group two as an example, but this would be the same trend for any group. So from this diagram it shows that the first ionisation energy decreases down group 2. Um, so in general that's the case for any group and that's because for each successive element the electron being removed is from a higher energy sublevel than the one before. So if we take beryllium and magnesium as examples um, if we write out the electronic configurations, so for beryllium um, it's got four electrons, so the electronic configuration is 1s2, 2s2, and then for magnesium it's got 12 electrons, so that electronic configuration is 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, and 3s2. So if we look at uh, which sublevels the outer electrons are in beryllium and magnesium. So in beryllium the outer electron is in a 2s sublevel, whereas in magnesium it's in the 3s sublevel. So the 3s sublevel is higher energy than the 2s sublevel. And notice that in magnesium um, there's more inner electrons, so it's got 10 inner electrons that are shielding the two outer electrons from the nucleus, whereas in beryllium it's only got two electrons to shield the two outer electrons. So the outer electron in magnesium is more shielded from the nucleus and it's further away. And so it's held on uh, less strongly than the outer electrons in beryllium. And so it's easier to remove. So I've just summarised it there. So going down the group, the outer electron is in a higher energy sublevel. Uh, so it's further away from the nucleus and it's more shielded from the nucleus by more inner electrons. And so it becomes easier to remove. And so that's why the ionisation energy decreases going down a group.